Hi everyone, oh, welcome back. Welcome to uh, episode 130. That's pretty wild. Okay, so in the comments, uh, you guys mentioned that I forgot uh, Stone of Baron Zaya in Pine Watch. So just off camera, I went and I collected it really quickly. It was kind of a pain in the ass to do, but I have it. So now with the Baron Zaya stones, I have, if I can find the quest here, uh, just go, oh, there we are, 13 out of 24. That's pretty exciting. So I only need, what is that, 11 more? Okay, sorry, just fixing the mic, okay. All right, so now we are going to talk to Astrid first, I think. Uh, okay, so to kill an empire. So it would appear all the contracts leading up to the emperor's assassination have been completed. I must now speak with Astrid and receive further instructions. So that is what we are doing. Right. Where is she? Where is she? So it's done. You've killed the gourmet. And now, Titus Mead II is as good as dead. So it's time we're ready to assassinate the Emperor. Oh, yes. And I've decided you will have the honor. Remain silent. <laughs> Look at you. So calm, so confident. I do believe you were born for this task. So let's begin. Go now to Castle Dower in solitude. Present the gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge, Commander Marrow. I'm sure you remember him. You'll gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able to poison his meal rather easily. Okay, which poison should I use? Here, take this. It's called Jaren Root. All it takes is one taste, and the effects are quite immediate. The Emperor will be serving Sithis before he even knows he's dead. Once Mead has been killed, escape through the upper door and across the bridge. I've arranged for it to be unguarded once the alarm is sounded. Now go, my friend. Go and fulfill your destiny as listener. Okay. Um, let's see. What else can you tell me about the Jaren root? It's a rare plant, found only on the island of Stros Mackay. It can be served like any vegetable, cut up, put in a salad, perhaps boiled in a stew. One taste will lead to nearly instant death, so don't even think about it. Okay, anything else before I set off? It took all the favors, bribes, and blackmails I could muster, but I've secured your exit out of the keep. Just follow my instructions, and the Dark Brotherhood will be back on top. All thanks to you, listener. Okay. Right then. All right, before we continue on, let me just see where these people are. I must kill Helvard, the house carl of Falkreath. Okay, so we can do that quickly just because we're outside of Falkreath. Right. Okay, and then this one. Kill Maluril. Uh, let's see, kill the wizard Maluril, who can be found investigating the dwarven ruin of... Mizen left. Sure. I definitely fuck that up. Okay, I may use any means, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Right. This is like the missing cargo stuff I've been randomly doing. Where's this? I'm just curious. Uh huh. Okay, the map didn't bring me to an area. That's fine. Okay. Uh, we'll figure that out later. Return. Oh, right. I have to do this one. 
Okay, that's gonna be kind of annoying. I kind of want to just get this done with. Um, okay, first let's just kill Hellbard. It might be hard to kill him during the day because he's going to be beside the Jarl. We might have to wait till evening. And I think it's like... Where's the sun? I think it's the morning. North. That's east. So that'd be west. Or maybe it's evening. Is the sun in the west? I guess I should just look at the time instead of trying to <laughs> guess based off of the sun. Uh, okay. I don't know why I'm going this way. Uh, okay, do you know, I need to change this. So I've been playing a couple other games and it's always like a little bit jarring going back into Skyrim with the controls. Okay, anyways. Okay, gotta go this way. Okay, we'll just see the state of the house Carl with the Jarl and if he's right beside the Jarl, then we'll definitely come back in the evening. That's not where I need to go. All right. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. I'm the steward here. I serve under Jarl Sidgir and Jarl Dengir before him. Where the fuck did he go? <laughs> Shit. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to do this right now. I might have to come back at night when everyone's sleeping. Yes, yes, what is it? We're all very busy here. Okay. Ah, oh, perfect. Are you going in this room alone? Sid Gear can sometimes act too quickly, but he does listen to Helvert and I. Yes, yes, what is it? We're all very busy here. They move his body to. Hmm. Ah, it's fine, whatever. Okay. Well, that's done with. I most <sighs> Okay, I think the plan will be to head to Markarth, and then from there I can take a carriage to Solitude. So what we'll do is we will uh, this one here. 
All right, so silver lining. Endon had a silver mold stolen while it was en route to my car. The item in question was taken by a group of bandits led by Rigel Strongarm and brought to their hideout at Pine Watch. So I've retrieved it and now I have to return. And this was a special job for the Best guild. defense is a good defense, am I right? So we will, I guess, go to Markarth. Maybe I should ride a horse. It's been a while since I've ridden a horse. Let's see, which one do I want? I feel like it's faster by running and not riding the horse. <laughs> like we're only at half moon mill, I don't know. Oh, I love this view though, coming out of like the mountains going down into this. I don't know, I guess you'd call this a valley. Or maybe not a valley, it's not like a tight valley. I don't know. It's kind of. Anyways, uh. Okay. Solitude, Rorkstead, Karth Waston, Markarth. This way. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Daedra Cores.
Wow, what a beautiful sunset. Oops, sorry, I'm distracted by the background. <laughs> Let's just enjoy it for a second. Okay, maybe that's a bad angle. Okay, I'm saving the game. <laughs> Feels like it's being glitchy. <laughs> okay. Oh. That's mean. Banning. Twice as much work here in the stable without him. Jeez. Wait. I know you. Blood and silver, friend. Move. He has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Need something? Thank you again for resolving my problem. You're welcome. I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer, and I just might- I'm gonna be a silver. I work silver, like, like my, father, my father, and his father before him. I have your silver mold. You've more than proven that the Thieves' Guild is back on its feet in our city, and earned every bit of your reward. Thank Tell you. Delvin that he can count on me to provide the influence around here with the right people when he needs it. If Perfect. you're ever looking to sell any illegally obtained merchandise, I'd also provide my services as a fence. It's the least I can do. Ooh, nice. How is business? Business is absolutely booming, my friend. I've taken to hiring a few extra men of my own just to keep up with all the shipments. Old Delvin certainly takes care of his own, doesn't he? What have you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. 
Yo, he has a lot of freaking gold on him. Oh my gosh. Okay, we can sell a lot of things. Um, okay, what do I have that's expensive? That. He gave me... Created potions are 20% more powerful. Um, created potions are 22% more powerful, so this is better. Okay, so I'm going to sell this because that... Okay. Uh, that could be useful. Uh, sure. Okay, weapons. I think that's good there. Keep the scrolls. Miscellaneous. Oh, those are that stolen. I'm just gonna like get rid of some of this stuff here for now. Uh, oh no. Oh, we'll just sell that. I don't really care about that. Okay. There we go. I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. Mm, I actually want to see if he has. Okay, he doesn't have any potions on him. I was like, maybe he has healing potions. Is this everything I just sold him? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> okay. When you get back to Riften. Tell Delvin this new arrangement's working out quite well. Oh, I will. I don't you worry. call a soldier of fortune. Problem. Make me an offer, and I just might fight at your side. Blood and st Okay. <laughs> All right, so now let's head to Solitude. Ah, uh, this way. Sorry. Wait. I know you. Although a part of me wants to return to Delvin, but we can do that after we assassinate the Emperor. Because I imagine I'll have to go back to the Brotherhood. Alright, so let's talk to the carriage driver and get a ride to Solitude. Oops, I gotta talk to you, not the horse. Traveling in the Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. There once was a hero named Ragnar, the red who came riding to right run from old Rorik's day. Oh, do you know what I was thinking for roleplay purposes? Since I'm gonna be like acting the part as a chef, I should go and get my chef's outfit. Do you know, actually maybe I can buy some chef's clothes from that like one store in Solitude that sells clothing. And if not, then I'm gonna have to go and get my chef's clothing that I stole. I'm hoping this store sells that though. Okay, what was the store called? I think it was like over here. Is it this one? Uh, it's not that one. Oh, it's this one. Is it not open yet? Frick, do I have to kill time? Oh my gosh, restoration. Uh, I just wanna see the time. Oh my gosh, 6 a.m. Um, okay, let's wait outside of the store for a few hours you know people do that they, they wait for stores to open Alrighty, i'm hoping she has what i need oh what a lot oh let me just take a look okay 
Ooh. Ooh, I could wear some cat. Oh, there we are, perfect. That and that. Okay, perfect. Oh, did you have a bad day? You'd think so, wouldn't you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. Okay. Finally. Watch what you're doing. Sorry. Okay, I think we will. You know, the winking skeever is not just the best inn in solitude. It's also the only inn in solitude. Okay. Do I not have a quest selected? What? <laughs> Okay, to kill an empire, using the writ of passage issued to the chef known as the Gourmet, I must enter Castle Dower and play the part of a culinary master who is scheduled to prepare a feast. This will be my opportunity to assassinate the emperor using any tools at my disposal. I mean, I was given a poison, so <laughs> that's what we'll use. Palace, you might want to rethink that outfit. Girl, I was just shopping. Alrighty. Keep the cold. Let's do this. All right, where is my chef's outfit? That. That. What the fuck? Fresh fish, straight from the fjords. All right. <laughs> That's an interesting chef's outfit. <laughs> uh, sure. Am I not wearing a necklace? Oh, it just doesn't show on the outfit. Okay. Um, all right, let's put away that. But we'll keep this. That's my chef's knife right there, guys. Oh, I guess I'm still wearing my gauntlets. Uh, my gloves. Backstubbed as doubled. All right, I guess this is uh, what we wear when we cook Keep food. <laughs> All right, so I have to go up this way, I think. We're late for our first day on the job as a chef. Don't suppose you'd enchant my sword. That old blade the city's can crawling with Imperial Legion, and you know what? I'm still nervous. Lazy and useless, a lot of them. They can't even keep the Stormcloaks in line. No way I trust them with the Emperor's life. You worry too much. They the Emperor's Ulfric never Stormcloak been safer. Murdered the high assassination with attempts his are voice. planned overnight. Shouted him we discovered the plot. End of threat. I suppose. Stop right there. The tower is off limits until further notice. So hi, I'm here as a chef. Actually, I want to read the writ of passage, passage before I give it away. Um, let's see. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's not under books. Oh, is it just a miscellaneous item? Uh, do you know what? That's fine. I'm going to pretend I didn't hear. Stop right there. The tower right. is off limits until further notice. Show Amaro the gourmet's writ of passage. What's this now? Uh, order of his eminence, possessor of these papers, the gourmet. By Azra, the gourmet. I am. I'm sorry. The clothes, of course. I, I should have realized. Please, excuse my ignorance. Gianna, the castle chef, has been eagerly awaiting your arrival. You should proceed to the kitchen straight away. Thank you. I'll forgive you this time. Don't let it happen again. Hmm. 
on another I'm delivery. here for work. I told you people our stocks are fine. Now put whatever you have over there, then get out. Bitch. You misunderstand. I am the gourmet. The gourmet? Oh, finally. When I heard the gourmet was being brought in to cook for the emperor, I could hardly believe it. It's just... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're a Nord? I never would have guessed it. But where in the world did you learn to cook like that? Here in Skyrim? Or maybe somewhere less... Enough, the gourmet is here to cook, not talk. Let us begin. Oh, yes, but of course. <clears throat> the Emperor has requested your signature dish. The potage le magnifique. I've taken the liberty of getting it <laughs> Sounds started. like me. <laughs> but the cookbook only says so much, and everyone makes the potage differently. I would be honored if we could make it the gourmet special way. The base broth is already boiled. We can get started right now. So, uh, which ingredient should I add next? Uh... Remain silent. Oh, I get it. This is a test, right? You want to see how well I know the potage le magnifique. Well then, I think a pinch of frost salt should do the trick, right? Now what? Uh, remain silent. My choice then? Oh, very well. I think we should add some chorus eggs for additional flavor. Uh, remain silent. Okay. Uh, let me see. Thistle. Yes. Uh, let's try that. Just a sprig Sounds or two. Sounds disgusting. Uh, what are you making? My choice. Hmm. All right then. Tomatoes. Simple, yet infinitely flavorful. Don't you agree? Well, I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavors. So, is that it? Uh, there's one final ingredient here at this. Oh, what is this? Some kind of herb? Are you sure? The potage tastes perfect as it is. Any other ingredient might... Are you questioning me? <laughs> How I'm sorry. Dare you? Of course, it's your most famous recipe after yeah. all. Yeah. All right then. Your secret ingredient's been added. And if I may say so, it has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the best chef in the entire empire. I'll carry the stew pot and lead the way up to the dining room. I'm sure the emperor and his guests are dying to meet you. Oh, I'm sure they're dying, all right. Oh my god. <laughs> but aren't you even a least bit nervous after everything that's happened? You mean the wedding? My cousin's apparent murder? An unfortunate misunderstanding. No more. Cold mead, hot tempers. These things happen. Quite. Yet that recent business with the young officer... Here we are. Gods, I'm nervous. We'll go in in just a moment. Please, I'll serve. You just stand there and be amazing. An unfortunate turn of events, that. But an isolated incident. And I have been assured that the fault was with the man's son alone. Truth is, we are in no danger whatsoever. Killing an emperor can be useful, but befriending one, now that's beneficial, as I'm sure you'd all agree. Aha, here we are, honored guests. I present to you the gourmet. Ah, the potage le magnifique. So delicious. My friends, as emperor, I of course reserve the right of first taste. <laughs> Oh, how marvelous. Just delicious. It is everything I had hoped it would be. It... I... I think something's wrong. I... <laughs> Someone do something! The gourmet and the chef have poisoned the emperor. Yes. Get them! Someone do something! What? No. No, you don't understand. There's been some kind of mistake. I... 
Fuck me. Oh fuck I'm You have a real fight. <laughs> fuck. Where do I go? No one can save you now. You're a dead woman. I could do this all day. Come on, somebody's on the big one. Listen, so here we go. This is what I've trained for. Where the fuck do I go? <laughs> this way. This way. Oh my god, I had to go. What you doing? I wanna search him. I wanna search him. I wanna search him. Where I go? This way. That man was by far the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. I'm glad he's dead. But I'm even happier that you killed him. You, an assassin for the Dark Brotherhood, just made an attempt on the Emperor's life. Would have succeeded had it been the real man. Surprised? So was I when a member of your family came to me with a plan. We worked out a deal, you see. An exchange. I get you, and the Dark Brotherhood gets to continue its existence. But you know what? I've changed my mind. How about this? I kill you, and butcher each and every one of your miserable little friends. Your sanctuary is being put to the sword right now. That's what I think of this deal. You killed my son. All of you. And now you'll pay the price. Kill her. And make sure there's nothing left to bury. Time to end this little game. Oh, I didn't want your bow. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? <sighs> I'm with the guild. You can make all your problems with the guards go away. But it'll cost you. What do you say? Uh, yeah, clear my back. Done. Now move along before you get me in trouble. Keep the cold at bay with our spiced wine. Where do I go? This way? Minus fishing. Okay, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> I think we're gonna go to Riften.
Oh wait, what is uh this quest now? <laughs> Alright, it was a trap. The Emperor was actually tied as me the second's devil and Commander Maro said I had been betrayed by someone within the Dark Brotherhood. Despite okay, I did not catch that. Despite his deal, Maro has sent troops to destroy the sanctuary. I must return there and help my family. Um yeah, we will return there. Definitely. Uh we're on our way. But first I want to go to Riften. Uh, where's the carriage? Need a ride? Please. We can take you to any of the whole Where do you want to go? Riften first, please. Climb and back and we'll be off. Steady old girl. Gotta keep my eyes open. I wonder who in the guild betrayed us. Hmm. Why well, should be Cicero? Cause I let him live, and he's pissed. <laughs> Gentlemen. Did you want something? Oh, I'm over. Sorry, lass. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. I don't know how to like lift it. Nope. Okay, can you get out of that screen? Fuck. Sure. We'll just have it rest like that, I guess. <laughs> I think it was like hanging here before it fell. But it's okay if it's like that. At least it's kind of on the floor. Okay, let's uh, go this way. Mm. No. Oh, right. I have the wrong quest selected. That's why. Sorry. Um, we got to... I'll talk to Delvin. Been doing a few jobs for Vex. How about you? Uh, this way. And then I think I just need to get white run jobs because I did Windhelm, I did Markarth, I did Solitude. The fuck. This way. What? Oh, this way. Oh my god. All right, Delvin. Got lots of jobs available. Interesting. Perfect. I finished that special solitude job. Erica assures me that Captain Wolf will spend pretty much the rest of his life clapped in irons. Best of all, he's also pledged to open doors for us in solitude and to get things rolling again. Success means the guild is getting stronger. We've picked up another merchant and a new recruit. Being a thief is like a second skin for you, ain't it? Never seen anything like it. If you don't watch out, you might even earn Vex's respect. That had me something, eh? Okay, I finished the special Markarth job. I hear Endon's quite pleased to have his merchandise back. He's a powerful ally in Markarth. Should help the guild regain a foothold in the west. Success means the guild is getting stronger. We've picked up another merchant and a new recruit. Being a thief is like a second skin for you, ain't it? Never seen anything like it. If you don't watch out, 
You might even earn Vex's respect. That would be something, eh? Okay. I'm ready for extra work. All right. Anything in particular strike your fancy? Numbers. All right. Got a simple one. Just get in, change the books, and be back in time for last call. So, how's about it? Sure. Finally. Someone with backbone. Here you go. White run, perfect. All right, and then Vex. I need a white run job. Ready for some you. work? Or I bet you are. Which one do you want? Uh, burglary. Good. Got a buyer in a rush for this item. If you hurry, we can turn it around and make a quick profit. Can you get it? I'm in. All right, take this and get out of here. Uh, rift in. No, we don't want that. Back with good news, I trust? I wanna quit. First you take the job, now you don't even want it? Wish you'd make up your mind. Give me one in white run, please. I bet you are. Which one do you want? Someone wants to see this mark suffer. They're paying a good bit of coin to have us plant the evidence in their house. You in? Yes. Here you go. Hope you don't muck it up. White run, perfect. Awesome. All right. Let's uh, see what these vendors look like over here. Even if you're one of us, you better not make trouble. Right, so this is the first one we got. If you're in the market for the finest bows money can buy, you're talking to the right person. Ooh, what do you have? Take a look. I don't, you don't even, you don't even sell any bow. Oh, you have a hunting bow and an imperial bow and a glass bow. Meh. Until next time. That's nothing. Ooh, nice. Need some sort of toxin for a special occasion? That's where I come in. Nice. Ooh, we got a blacksmith here. That's exciting. Looking for the best smith in Skyrim? You found it. Look at the thieves' guild go. This is so nice. Hi. And this will probably be a spot where they set up shop, right? I don't care if you're best buddies with the guildmaster. I'll still smash in your skull if you try it. Yeah, there's just one more spot, so that's the white run job, I guess. That goes right there, and then the Thieves' Guild is like, rebuilt, so that's so nice. All right, well, let's- So, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? Get out of here now. Doesn't look like much to me. Okay, before I return to, um, uh, the uh, sanctuary. I want to do Still just all these the extra ropes, jobs. But I'll get the hang of it. Oh, are you new? We haven't met. How? No, we haven't. How did somebody like you join the guild? It's kind of an amusing tale. I was making my way down the road from Iverstead towards Riften, and I saw Vex fighting off a couple of wolves. She needed help with some wolves? Well, there were eight of them, and she'd already killed three by the time I joined the fight. Together, we made sure work of them, and the last one limped away, licking its wounds. Is that when she asked you to join? Actually, that's when she politely asked me to hand over my coin purse. Can you imagine? <laughs> we scuffled for a while, broke each other's weapons, and finally fell to the ground exhausted. A stalemate? Indeed. After a few minutes, she looked me dead in the eye and asked me if I wanted to join the guild. Just like that. No apologies. 
That was big of you to accept. Something told me I wouldn't regret it. I had heard the guild was back on its feet again, and most of Skyrim under its belt. I'll tell you, I wouldn't want to cross blades with Vex again, but I certainly wouldn't mind a bit of a scuffle. Okay. Good luck on your next job. Okay, we know you. Sorry, lass. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Mm. Right. What's going on? Yeah, you need some. Oh, I'm still wearing this. Uh, I should change my clothing. Need a ride? I can take you to where do you want to go? Uh white run, please, sir. Climb and back and we'll be off. Oh, steady old girl. Oh wow, look how beautiful. So let's see my jobs. All right. Uh, let's do the shield job first. Plant a stolen flawless diamond in Carlotta Valentina's house in Whiterun. All right, I'll do that first. I don't think I've been in her house. She likes me. I'm sorry. Oh, I didn't mean to steal her gold. <laughs> oh, I feel bad. She only had four coins in there. And we are friends. I just, I'm loyal to the Thieves Guild right now. Really trying to, uh, to, uh, help them out here. Okay, I definitely... Where the frig is this flawless friggin... Oh, no. Wait, what? Oh, it's called Stolen Flawless Diamond. Uh, store. Um... 
I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Keep your hands to yourself. Bitch, I was just saying hi. No, that's me and I shouldn't call her a bitch. Okay. Oh, look how beautiful. Oh, wow. Like, I know this is just a game, but Skyrim is so freaking beautiful. Oh, my God. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay. Oops, wrong button. Sorry. Okay. She'll draw. No, now we need the numbers job. All right, I've been told to forge false entries in the ledger at Bellathor's. Oh, he's another friend of ours. I think we also uh, invested in his business, I think. So I kind of feel bad for screwing him over. But, you know, maybe this will benefit him also. Maybe he, like, requested we do this. Oh, no. Shit. Okay, is there a... There's a back Wait, entrance, right? I know you. No, you don't. There we go. Okay. Ooh. Is there anything I can, like, take? Not really. Okay, we gotta go upstairs. Nope. How the hell do I get upstairs? Okay. That way, okay. Okay, now I think I'm just gonna go to my house and just drop off some of the some of this like extra stuff I'm carrying. Uh, we'll just drop it off in this. There's house a nip here. in the air. Cold won't be good for my crops. Never is. Oh, why is Hilda in here? Do you know what? Since Hilda is here, let me um, empty her because I think she's carrying a bunch of stuff for me. Yeah. gonna have to go through all of this stuff later <laughs> all right we will store you uh, store you okay and I have a bunch of apparel uh, we don't need the chef's clothing anymore um, we don't need that anymore store that store that store that that, 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 and our weight is down, kind of, perfect. Uh, let's see here, we'll store, I think I'll just store some of this ore, and then the ingots that I don't need. Um, let's see, I'll just store that uh, Oh, that's... Oh, I need to do that in uh, Riften. Okay, that's right. I have to remember to go to that uh, that person. Okay. The Willendrilla or whatever her name is. Okay. Alright. <sighs> so beautiful. Wow. Alright. What's the hurry? A beautiful night.
Okay, I think I'm just gonna go to Riften first. Need a ride? Just to, can take you to any of the hold hand in all of those so I can get the special job. Um, let's Where do go. you want to go? Riften, please. Climb and back, and we'll be off. I just really want to finish off the Thieves Guild stuff. You'd best hurry it up. Sorry, I was going to the Thieves Guild off camera because I thought it was just really repetitive for you guys and my controller just vibrated. I think there's a dragon. <laughs> I'm just gonna go fight this dragon first. Oh, is it actually attacking in Riften? Or is it out of Riften? Okay, let's go out of Riften then. All right, where's this dragon? Is it gone? Are you a little dick? No! <laughs> Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I think it's gone. All right, okay. I will see you guys in the Thieves Guild. <laughs> all right. Sorry, lass. I've got important. Let's talk to Vex first. Things to do. We'll speak another Just time. Just because I want the money from that job. Stealing and with no strings attached. Not bad. Here, got some coin for you. Thank you. Walking away with. Taking a job? It's like passing a bloated coin purse on a table. Right. Oh, uh, you're back. I've completed the numbers job. Ooh, nicely done. Here's your share. So what's the special request? We actually got a request from one of the most powerful families in Whiterun. The Battle Boards. Make your way up there and look for Alfred. He says he's got a matter that requires a delicate touch, but I suggested you for the job. Don't make Amazing. me the fool and let me down. All right? Have I let you down before? Ooh, can you train me to stick sneak? with me, and he'll never even know you're there. Oh, you can't train me anymore. Okay. Where are you off to? There's work to be done. Sorry, All right. boss. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Actually, do you know what? I think right here is where I'm going to end the game for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I think at the start of next video, we'll just complete this like Thieves Guild job thing. And then we'll make our way to Falkreath and deal with like what's going on over there. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.